Hey guys, um, it's a bit of a weird one today. Um, progress was going fantastic until about half an, well, an hour ago, I guess now. Um, I've got a gigabyte laptop and I've got a smart update software that tells you what drivers and uh, what BIOS firmware you need to upgrade to kind of prompts you when you need it and sure upgrade the BIOS on my laptop I was in the middle of working but I thought yeah well save up and go on to the next thing and just uh, let it restart and we'll carry on working so that's not going to be possible because uh, I've just fritzed the uh, BIOS um, the good news is is that I've got three episodes to release Four episodes to release, um, which I'm going to be doing uh, when I get onto a computer like the one right behind me, to <laughs> to release the ones I've got done. Um, the the other good news is is that I have a dog come to visit me, and beyond that, I've got also. Um, I'm able to buy a BIOS chip to replace the one on my laptop. Um, so with any luck, I should be able to get um, up and running again by the time I get to the US. I'm going to order it online and get it shipped to somewhere in the US because Mexican Post is not trustworthy. Anywho, and that's what I'm going to do. That's my plan. But it kind of really... It, you know, it seems to be one obstacle after another after another. Um, and I have to say that the biggest problems I've always had on these trips is always the technology. Um, the simplest things never break, you know. They might be inefficient, but they, um, they never seem to break, or you can always adapt them to make them work. Um, Electronics seem to be just a nightmare. I mean, I was I was counting my lucky stars just the other day. I was thinking, you know, it's uncanny. My laptop I took through Africa, I cracked the screen, I think about, about halfway through the trip, but I was still able to use some of the screen real estate. So I was able to like kind of move my things across and then by the time I was in Namibia I have no idea what happened this was back in Windows 2000 maybe it was XP maybe 2000 I don't know this is a it was an old operating system even for the day and um, I literally I, I got a boot error and I couldn't boot up the laptop until I got back to the UK so I wasn't able to carry on writing any blog posts which was such a nightmare but this thing was stood up the test of time I've worked I've rendered videos for professionally for the past year on this thing and it hasn't failed me once but that firmware update for this BIOS was not the one um, so I'm, I'm setting off from Mexico City next Monday, maybe a little bit sooner. Um, and I'm going to ride up through... What's the names of these places? Um, I'm going to be riding up through Mexico into Arizona. I've got, I've got a route going through some beautiful areas in Mexico. And I'm going to enjoy it. I'm going to take my time. And now that I've got this distraction right here to deal with, I guess I'll just have to carry on riding. Um, so that's me and a cupcake again. I don't know why I keep saying cupcake. Nutshell. Neil in a nutshell. Hmm. Anyhow, thank you for watching. <laughs>